Hi boys and girls, it's time to make another musical instrument. This one just might be Susie Sunshine's absolute favorite so far. <laughs> I like to call it the bottle bugle, but its actual name is a membranophone. Wow, that's super fancy. <laughs> a membranophone is a musical instrument where the sound that is made is mostly from the vibrating of a membrane. Our membrane today is a balloon. <laughs> Let's get started. We'll need a balloon, a hole puncher, a really good one, a pair of scissors, a straw, a little bit of tape, some construction paper, and a super sturdy plastic bottle. I used a Ribena bottle that was out of my fridge. Now, as a tip, I tried to use a water bottle. Susie doesn't really have many of those around, but it was super flimsy, so it didn't work very well. So I used my Ribena bottle. <laughs> so you empty the bottle and clean it out, and then you get an adult to cut off just the top, leaving the bottom. And that's what we're gonna be using for our membrana phone the top part of a really sturdy plastic bottle. Now, then you're gonna put a hole right near the top. You need a really strong hole puncher to do that. Just one hole. And then we'll put this to the side. The next step is to take a piece of construction paper and to roll it up nice and tight. It's going to fit right inside the top of the water bottle, but it has to fit tight because remember we talked before about how vibration makes sound. So we're going to be blowing air into it and we don't want the air to have a lot of places to escape. So when this fits in, it should fit in. Oh, that's good and tight. I like that. I'll let it out just a little bit more. We want it to be a little tricky to get in. And we'll push it down. Now it's good and tight. It's not gonna go anywhere, but I'm gonna put a little piece of tape here anyway. Just to keep the paper sturdy. There you go. Straight up through there. Now we're going to get our membrane or our balloon and we're going to cut off the bottom just like we did with our drums. And then we won't need this part. We're going to take our balloon and stretch it over the top. Now the thing is we want to make the balloon nice and tight. We want to stretch it really far. So that it's good and solid. You may want to pull it if there's any gaps. Then what we need to do is find where the hole was and take our straw and put it into the hole and then pull it down. So we have our straw. <laughs> now, if you watch, Susie's going to push up to make the music. We're going to push up on our paper so that it's good and tight because what we're going to do is we're going to blow air into our membrana phone and the air is going to look for a way to get out. And when the air is blowing, it's going to start to vibrate. That's where it's going to make the sound. But the sound will change depending on how we let the air get out. Are you ready? So remember, we're going to push. What I like to do is put my thumb here so that I can push it up and down. You see how it's going up and down, up and down because that's how it's gonna make the different sounds. Now, I didn't need to put tape.
to hold the balloon on because the balloon fits good and snug. In. Now we're going to start blowing. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? <laughs> Our membranophone or bottle bugle. <laughs> 